grew up in Baton on the north side. We say her, we say there. It's your girl, Alicia Jones. Welcome back to my channel. And today, this video is gonna be different from all my other videos that y'all used to seeing. Um, in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a St. Louis accent tag, challenge, whatever you wanna call it. So it's been brought to my attention and I never really tripped off, the, I never tripped off this fact that I have an accent. <laughs> like a couple people told me that I got an accent and I was like, what? I don't. I do not. I do not got on accent. I was, I was straight like battling. So, um, I watched the old news clip of me giving an interview and I was like, uh, bruh, <laughs> I do got an accent. So I thought it would be fun if I, um, did this accent tag. Now y'all better be nice in the comments cause I didn't see some of the videos. This one dude, he did a video. And they was flaming him. Like they was <laughs> they was going in on him in the comments. So so usually when I do my videos, I try to be like kind of proper or whatever. So in this one, I'ma just be myself, like as if I'm talking to my friends, you know. So that's what we're about to do. So let's go ahead and get on with this. So I got some questions and um this first question is what is it called? when you throw toilet paper on a house. TP. Uh, the next one, what is the ball, what is the bug called that curls in a ball when you touch it? A roly poly. Uh, three is, what is the bubbly carbonated drink called? Here we call it soda. Um, I think in the South they call it pop. So uh, yeah, we call it soda here. Uh, number four, what do you call gym shoes? We call them tennis shoes or kicks. Uh, I don't say sneakers. I don't never say sneakers. Tennis shoes, kicks. Um, what do you say to address a group of people? So for me, whenever I uh, go somewhere, I always say, how y'all doing? You know what I'm saying? How y'all doing? That's what I just say. Especially if it's some older people, I just say, how y'all doing? I don't ever be like, hey, what's up? That, that's not me. I just say, how y'all doing? Uh, six is, what do you call the spider with really long legs and an oval shaped body? A daddy long legs. What do you call your grandparents? Uh, when my grandpa was alive, I called him grandpa. Uh, the kids, their great grandma was called uh, Medea and on their granny side and on their grandpa side. They called her Ma, so, but I used to say, I just say Grandma, Grandpa. What do you call the contraption, the wheel contraption that you put groceries in at the grocery store? Cart, buggy. Uh, I got two more. Oh, I ain't right, I ain't got number 10. Oh, that's it. What is the thing you change the channel with? Okay, so, people say remote. But I'm gonna be honest with y'all, when I grew up and I still say it, I said mo control, like mo control. Where's the remote? Mo control, where the mo control at? That mo control, that's what we just said. Like <laughs> it sounds so bad, but it mo control. Where is it? All right, so now we're about to get into some slang. And um the first one is drove. So drove, like you drove. That mean like you silly or you just doing something stupid. It's kind of like for me, like you had a blind moment. Like, oh man, you hella drove. Like you got your shoes on the wrong feet. You too old for that, you drove or something like that. Um, hella, hella basically is like a lot. Like uh, say I'm fixing my plate and I like pile it up to the top. And somebody's like, yo, you got hella food on that plate. It's basically another word for a lot. Or like, she hella bad or she hella fine. He hella cute. Like, ooh, you know, something like that. Mug. Mug. I don't use mug that much. Like, I used to a lot. But uh, mug is basically the object you talking about at the moment. Like, that mug, 
Like, say you talking about a car or something, and you be like, that car right there, that mug nice. You know what I'm saying? That mug lit, that mug fire, something like that. Uh, ooh, scan. Scan. Scan is short for scandalous. So, um, say I got a best friend, she come on my house, I got $20 sitting over there, and she take it. I see her take it, and I'm like, yo, I just seen you do that, you hella scan, like, for real? Or... If we all go out to the club, me and my friends, and they ready to go, and I ain't ready to leave, and they just leave me, I'd be like, y'all, y'all, y'all hella scan for that. Y'all left me, something like that. Uh, tripping, tripping mean basically like you doing too much. I use tripping a lot, like tripping. I use tripping a lot. I use hella a lot, but tripping is basically when you doing too much. Like, yo, you tripping right now. You need, you need a chill, something like that. So. Say like my kids is like getting on my nerves. <laughs> I'm gonna say, yo, why y'all so loud right now? You tripping? Y'all need to calm down. Next word is fire. Favorite word to use? Fire. We don't. I don't say fire. That's like the proper. We say far, far. Like your hair is hella far. Like. That outfit is fire. This full fire. Like that mac and cheese you made last night was fire. Uh, Joan. <laughs> I don't use Joan as much as I used to. When we was kids, we used Joan all the time. So Joan is basically when you cracking jokes on people. You know, you know, like comedy when they be like joning on a person or something like that. So it's basically when I'm going in, I'm making a joke about you. I'm about to light you up, Joan, and like. Get them. <laughs> I'm like so ill right now. But it's basically when you talk about somebody like, yo, you flooding. You flooding. Your pants too short. You just, just like when you going in on somebody. And slide. Like slide is basically when you uh, finna come through. Like I'm talking like late at night. And yo, uh, boo thing talking about something. He want to slide through. Like he finna come over. You know. I don't think I use finna in none of my videos, but basically it's like, yo, I'm finna slide on you real quick. Where you at? Like you, oh, you at O'Fallon? Yeah, I'm finna slide on you right quick. Um, uh, ooh, let's get into the food. So, if you in St. Louis or if you're gonna be visiting St. Louis or whatever like that, one of the most popular foods here is Emo. Emo's the square beyond compared to pizza. It's it's a flat thin pizza. Um I don't eat cheese like I like I used to, so I don't eat it as much. But I'm gonna tell you, like some wings and some pizza, like a pepperoni and bacon pizza, used to be that thing. I used to love that so much from Emos. And next we got the Chinese place. Uh, Chinese place to me, St. Louis got the best Chinese rice. Now we do call our Chinese place something else, but I'm not gonna call it what everybody calls it. Um. But basically, we got the rice that don't got no peas in it. If your rice got peas in it, that ain't it. <laughs> so we got the best rice. Uh, them St. Paul's are fire. Uh, shrimp St. Paul is the best. Uh, with some crab ragoons and a vest. You cannot leave a rice place without getting a vest. And my favorite vest sodas are black cherry, peach, uh, lemon, like all of the vests. Except for root beer and cream. Those are the best. So if you come in here, you gotta get a, uh, you gotta hit up them Chinese places and you gotta get you a vest to go with it cause it's not gonna be complete without that. Uh, Red Hot Ripplets, those are the chips. They're real, real spicy, uh, but they St. Louis chips. So um, they're good. I don't eat them that much cause they hella hot, but they good. Ted Drews, we got Ted Drews frozen custard. Uh, the chocolate is the best one. Uh, it's just like basically an ice cream place. Uh, Crown Candy. Crown Candy's really popular. It's on the south side. They got ice cream and it's, it's, it's good. And then we got St. Louis style barbecue, St. Louis style ribs. Those are also really, really good. So yeah, that is pretty much it for this tag. But don't be in the comments about all oh, you ain't from St. Louis because I grew up in Baton on the north side. And then once I left the north side, I moved over to the west side. I stayed on Maple. I stayed on Julian. Uh, when I was 
when I lived in Baton, I stayed on Gas Place. It was like on the corner of Hornsby, like a five minute walk from Baton School. So yeah, we used to walk to Hickey Park. We used to go to Dynamite. Dynamite, and when Dynamite closed up, they had uh, what was it? Uh, Sterling's Marketplace. I miss Sterling's Marketplace so much because it had so much in there. It had the grocery store. Sterling Marketplace had it was the like grocery store one side. They had like a a movie rental place up in there, and then they had uh a beauty supply up in there, and they had a lot of other stores, y'all. I miss that. But uh, Hickey Park still there. But yeah, so we say her, we say their, we say finna, we say all that. So uh, if y'all like this video, go ahead and like it, comment, subscribe. I hope y'all like my little accent or whatever, <laughs> which I know that I have now since several people told me I got it. And then I actually listened to myself and I was like, mm -hmm. I kind of got like a love hate relationship with my accent sometimes I find myself like when I'm when I'm here at home I just let it be whatever it is and then when I'm out there I try to be a little proper unless I'm with my friends but yeah y'all I'm talking too much I'll see y'all in the next video I hope y'all like this one peace like the way you do that right there uh what was the other one breathe in breathe out and my favorite hell yeah